Matthew chapter 4, the Satan told Jesus and said, bow down to me and I will give you the glories of what? This world. So men that have journeyed in the spirit know that there are certain principalities, spirit that operate in the realm of influence that have the capacity to bestow men with influence, power, money. My father told me many years ago that at some point, in it, are you hearing what I'm saying? Yes, sir. At some point in his ministry in mid-90s, huh? the spirit of the water rose up and met him. He said, the spirit has come two times. You know, for everybody that has genuine prophetic, you will encounter that spirit. Because the prophetic is almost always connected with finance. Are you getting the point? So what they will do, if you don't partner with them, they will remove finance from you. Or they will fight your finance. Are you getting the point? Are you getting the point? Yes. So, the spirit told my father that if, now, my father's gift, genuine, calling genuine, but a spirit has met him. And what the spirit is demanding is not much. What the spirit is demanding is partnership. Not for you to drop the name of your ministry or what you are doing. Or preaching people go to hellfire. Are you getting what I'm saying? I'm teaching you spiritual dynamics. Two times the spirit rose from. He told us that that's, that's spirit in water. That he has seen that spirit. He came and met him twice and said, can we partner? Can can your ministry and calling be corrupted? That's all we need. We don't need it to be taken away. We need it to be what? So that every man that drinks from your fountain will drink a corrupted fountain. Let me stop here. Because there is something your mind is telling you and that's not what I'm saying. Amen? Amen. No, no, no. That's not. I'm just trying to grant you spiritual what? Intelligence. And there are people like that that function that way. Ministers that were genuine suddenly they encountered the heavy spirit. And when they encountered the spirit, the spirit told them, Just sleep with me. When you sleep with me, I will grant you influence. Your ministry will not stop. In fact, the way you are preaching will not stop. In fact, people will still be falling on the ground, but your gift and grace, your anointing has been corrupted. If people don't realize that anointing will be corrupted, then there is a problem. Because Jesus said that there are many that will do signs, do miracles, and that last day I will say, I don't want to know you. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Yes, Two times the Spirit came. Two times. Two times. Many times there are certain levels, layers of Spirit that will not come and encounter you that way if you don't have a very high and, and, and unique destiny. Because they have seen the powers that God granted to your ordination. And they know they can't stop you entirely. But they want to benefit in the profit. Are you getting the point? Yes. What Satan wants is when profit is coming, God will take 50. He will take 50. He knew. He has already known that there is no way. If he tries to remove you, that he can't make you to stop. You have priests. Are you getting the point? Yes. The way you are now, you can't say, I'm no more born. I can't, you can't stop this anymore. So he said, since we can't stop this man, can we gain profit? So he will invest. So after me, invest investment, investment. and then profit. I didn't hear you. So after me, investment. investment. Then what? Profit. If I what? Investment. And then what? Profit. Yes. So Satan will invest. He will invest something in your life. And then profit will start coming. Some of them once they sleep with that demon spirit. They will start corrupting their generation with the spirit of immorality. Things can happen though, for people, but when they lay hands on your head, you struggle with immorality all your life. Young men of God that God called, genuine call, they cannot trace what is wrong with their life anymore. It is because somebody laid hands on you. And things began. If that person has made a pact with Satan. And you as a person can never go to Satan. But you are in search of an impartation. And you collected one. Huh? There are many young pastors. They are suffering from impartations. Their problem is imparted. Lack of pure streams. So when they come to our meeting. What we are doing first of all is deliverance. To deliver you from. Have you seen somebody that. Went to swim. 
Eh? You went to swim and then you don't know how to swim and water. That water, some of them poo poo inside. All of them entered your mouth. When you come to our meeting, we don't we don't serve you fresh water. We don't. You are. It is wrong for you to start serving somebody fresh water. What you do is bring his stomach like this and do what? And remove those garbage you drank. Hey! Some people need serious help. And guess what? Many of them continued with ministry, hoping that just because you are continuing things will change. It is the fountain that is corrupted, not the tributary. So you cannot remove water and it will change. It will need to go to the fountain and remove the source of corruption for the fountain to begin to flow. 